Hey, how's it going everybody? This is GC Performance here, back with another video. Today I have for you guys the Specialized S-Works Evade 2. Um, obviously I'm doing this video because I just did the announcement for the giveaway. And I kind of want to go over some, uh, some specs on this helmet to let you guys know what you guys could be possibly winning. And I mean, I appreciate all the feedback and support I'm getting. Obviously I know I'm giving away a helmet, but I mean, the, the love and support in the comment section for sure, it, it makes, you know, it just makes it all better. I'm still very overwhelmed and, um, and I'm very excited about the whole situation. But I'm still very overwhelmed on once I get to it. I might cut the, 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 the entries to instead of being two weeks to maybe a week, but I'll decide that later on the week. But uh, I'll keep you guys updated and uh, I'm very excited for us all to happen. So this is the Specialized S-Works Evade and it comes with the Angie. It retails for $275. So this is gonna be their aerodynamic helmet. And what that means is that, uh, you know, as you can see, there's not much ventilation on the holes on here. It's gonna be more of a helmet that's um, more for the aero speed. And so what Specialized claims is, is that this helmet is going to be about uh, 200, I'm sorry, 50 seconds faster over 40 kilometers than the traditional helmet, which I mean, that's huge, huge uh, time. If you think about it, if you just, I know everyone's saying 50 seconds, that's not a big deal. But if you stand there and literally count out 50 seconds from someone crossing a finish line, it's absolutely insane. So 50 seconds over 40 kilometers. And then they're also saying that this is the, the two model, but they're actually saying that this model is going to be six seconds faster than the first generation of the Evade. And then they also added this newer um, ventilation here. And what the ventilation does is that, that with the venting holes, it's not only um, allowing free flow air to go through it, but it's also gonna make it cooler as well. So not only are you gonna get the benefit to more free speed and more aerodynamics, but you're gonna get more ventilation too. So on this helmet, it does come equipped with the Angie system by Specialized right there. One second, I'll focus on there. Um, that does come with the Angie system and also the hairnet back here, so you can actually dial this in. So this is going to be a a, uh, a dial system back here that you can adjust them. They come in small, medium, and large. And so if you need to adjust the helmet on here, you just go ahead and turn this dial right here. Open or big. And then what this Angie system does is that this thing will literally, sorry about that. Um, they give you, this used to be where you had to pay for the feature. Um, now they're gonna give you the subscription for lifetime for free. So this is a crash activated system. So if you are riding by yourself and you were for God forbid to get hit or have a crash in that and you activate this with your specialized app, um, this will notify the authorities and notify whoever's on your contact list to let them know that you're in a crash and that way you can get some help right away. So it is a huge um, key feature that they're including free for the helmet. Granted it is $275, but it's a nice feature to have that Angie on there as well. Um, not only does this go dial in and out, but you can also adjust on the inside. See how it has those meters right there, the five, four, three, and two, one. You can lower this down to fit your cranium if you have a little bit taller head or lower sitting head as well. And then you can see right here, this has the MIPS in here. Now, this is a really cool feature. This is only done by Specialized um, MIPS SL. So this is exclusive to Specialized products. They got together with MIPS and this is called their MIPS SL. What this feature does is that um, uh, while actually riding or, or, or they develop the system, it's not that big yellow shell that you know of MIPS to have. They have this little wrist watch kind of looking things inside there. Um, hold on one second, guys. Let me just do this real quick. Give me two seconds. Boom, sorry about that. Let's try something new for filming, didn't work out. Anyways. Um, see these little kind of, this, they call it their patented wristwatch SL. Um, that's gonna be the MIPS technology in there. So it gives you about, they said 10 to 15 millimeters of movement. So and what that does again, it disperses that kinetic energy. So if you were to take a crash or you were to take a spill, that uh, those little lollipop things are going to allow the helmet shell to move and not actually drag your helmet head. And uh, that saves and reduces a lot of weight compared to the actual uh, regular MIPS, which is that big bulky yellow shell. So that is only exclusive to Specialized on there. Um, there that's their, their normal padding foam here. They put a nice foam inside here. These are all replaceable as well. And then, let me get some views of this as well. This one looks beautiful. This is the white color right here. They make it in a the black, they make it in an ion. Um, Specialized proclaiming this thing weighs in about approximately 300 grams. Let's go ahead and see right here. So this is a size medium. Let's weigh this sucker right here. 
So 312 grams, so they're, they're, they're 12 grams off, but it said approximately, so we'll give them kudos on that. Um, but yeah, so $275, this is a, so now my personal opinion on this, on this helmet, I have the Prevail, I have the Evade, I don't have the Evade 2, I have the Evade 1, and you can really feel it or notice the difference on the two of them. Um, with the Prevail, yes, it's cooler. Uh, you, you have more ventilation, you feel that, but also you hear the chatter, like when you're riding, you stick your head up to see above, to see the rise in front of you, you can hear that wind grab, like as if you're rolling down a window in a car. On the Evade, when you go ahead and stick your head up, or you get out of your riding position, you look for it. I mean, it's almost dead quiet, like you're walking. So it is noticeably different. And mentally, after I had that first ride on the Evade, uh, 50 seconds over 40 kilometers is huge, but mentally after riding that, I'll take any kind of free speed I can get in a group. So uh, I can't go back to Prevail, to be honest with you. I mean, I just feel, I feel as if whenever I had the Prevail on, I know it sounds dumb, but I feel that, uh, that I, I just feel like I'm getting dragged behind, which is crazy. So mentally, it's, it's, a, it's a huge plus to me that I, that I enjoy this Evade. Um, but yeah, this is a, uh, oh, and also let me go over the magnetic, uh, <laughs> sorry, the magnetic uh, strap. So the Evade is known to have this on here. This is for uh, triathlons or going through transitions from stage to stage. So instead of it being a buckle, all it is just a little magnetic strap right here. So you just push this forward, it clips off, and then to clip back on, and this is a very tough with one hand, but it should just slide right back into place like that. And that's going to be just enough. People always say, well, what's going to happen if you get into a crash? It's going to lock in place. Once this thing slides in, it locks, you're good to go. You actually have to physically push forward to open on it and it slides in place. So it will lock in place once you're there, which is a big plus. So that magnetic strap as well, too. Big fan of that. Anything to be innovative to make it easier for you to take on off the helmet or, you know, just to get a little couple of cool style points as well. Um, but, yeah, that's going to do it for this video, guys. Let me know what you guys think about this helmet if you guys think it's worth the money for the 275 i know everyone thinks like whenever i throw these numbers out for wind tunnels um it's it's crazy to me because a lot of people do say like hey 40 seconds 50 seconds over 40 kilometers like what's that to me that's it's nothing but they're 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 proclaiming those numbers to anyone who's competitive anyone who's a racer anyone who wants that free speed they're proclaiming those numbers for that reason so uh, when they make these numbers and make these accusations, they're actually going to allow it to be a little bit faster than average. So in a race where it comes down to seconds, like the Tour de France stage or whatever like that, you're going to gain a lot more free speed on that on that um, in that position from first to second to third. Those 40 seconds are uh, are, are are crazy. So yeah, um, but yeah, let me know what you guys think. If you guys are enjoying this video, please leave a thumbs up on there and I. Uh, I will see you guys in the next video. Thank you so much. Hey guys, sorry about that. A uh, customer came up there while I was just finishing up the outro. He didn't realize I was recording. So, um, like I was saying about the wind tunnel test um, and the numbers that they proclaim on these helmets and the numbers they give out, the, the 50 seconds over 40 kilometers, usually my consumers are like, hey, that's not me. You know, that's not for that. It's just an added bonus. I know people aren't looking at the numbers and be like, oh, that's insane. But the competitors who are riding these helmets or the competitors who are looking for the group rides any little advantage for those numbers is great i mean you're getting that added free speed so they're doing the development and specialize is i think the only the only company that that i know of they have a wind tunnel on site that i've been to where they can test and make these products inside the wind tunnels so when they're making these helmets or they're making the bikes they're making everything they're getting to get live numbers back right as they're working on them and it gives them that much more benefit to make the helmet fast or whatever so the, i mean like this helmet right here, they're saying it's the most aero and fastest helmet out. They're saying it's the most coolest uh, helmet out, most coolest aero helmet out. Like cool as in like a uh, ventilated. So um, they get to literally like do a mold to it and they can see how it reacts in the wind tunnel with real numbers. So that is very beneficial to, you know, the R&D. And that's why this helmet does cost so much money is because, you know, they put a lot of money into the research development. So, um, but yeah, let me know what you guys think about the helmet. Um, if you guys are... Uh, big fans of it, please leave a, a like and a thumbs up down in the comments below. Let me know if you like this helmet or the Prevail. And uh, I probably will do the Prevail helmet later on down in the future to kind of show you guys the difference between the two of them. There's not that big difference of, um, there's not a lot to say about it, it's just very ventilated, but I'll go over the details on that. But yeah, uh, again, guys, thank you so much for everything. You guys are amazing. The comments I've been getting are great for the great giveaway. I, I'm excited for the giveaway as well. I'm excited to see what happens. The only thing I know what to do is to do an Excel spreadsheet so and then uh, i guess i'll have to sit there and enter them all but it's fun for me i don't i really don't mind at all i'm enjoying this a lot this is a really cool process so but yeah let me know what you guys think about the evade helmet if you guys have any questions tech specs please leave me a comment down below 
Um, and if you guys could, please leave a like and a, and a thumbs up on the video and subscribe if you haven't because I'm going to have more content like this coming out. I have some Scott 2021 bikes coming in, like some Attics. I have a Tarmac base model coming in. I have a Tarmac Pro coming in. Um, more, more, I have an S-Works Creo here, uh, which is a, a S-Works road bike with electric motor that does 20% assistance. So I got, I got videos coming up for days. So let me know what you guys think, and I will see you guys in the next video. Thank you so much. Bye.